what we have here is a little craftsman chainsaw. This was given to me by my kind neighbors because the isolation spring in the handle here is no longer attached to the head, the engine head. I've already started disassembly. It wasn't this uh, wasn't this bad when I got it. This spring in here, you can see, is supposed to go into this pocket in there. So I'm going to haul her apart a little more and see what I can see. All right. Fortunately, uh, my neighbor had gotten some of these spare parts, some of these replacement springs and things and tried to fix it himself and never got it to go together. So we're making some progress. We have this first one uh, screwed in place. That's uh, how it should be. But there's one <coughs> missing out of here. One missing that goes through here that holds this corner. So I'll see if I can make some sort of substitution out of these parts that we, that we have here. Okay, so I found this spring in the uh, bunch of spare parts and I nipped the little hook off of it, the little mounting hook off of it because there's a pocket down in here on the body side of the saw that's big and wide and I think this will fit in it and then the narrower end of the spring the other end of the spring should fit up here in the in the handle size I appreciate that you really can't see in here but that conical shaped spring fit in there perfectly and uh, I used a screw I think I saved out of a shelving unit I built or something. And uh, that seems to be a pretty good compatible match. I'm going to bolt the rest of the handle together and see how it feels. So, there's the handle all bolted back together. Nice little saw and you can see there is give in the handle. It looks all fine there, and uh, one funny Phillips screw that's not supposed to be there. But uh, it's all good. I have to tighten that chain up a little bit. And then we can get right down to some real world testing with the saw. Nah, just kidding. Clearly you see here that the saw will cut wood, but uh, that was never actually in doubt. You know, what I'm really testing is the isolation mounting of the handle, and the saw felt great in my hands, and I'm really pleased with this project.